Hey, what's going on everybody? It's me, Andy, and welcome back to Minecraft a Pocket Edition. So, uh, this right here, uh, we've got the 1.2 beta update, uh, officially released, like, uh, 1.5 or 1.4, so, uh, currently the latest version right here, uh, is actually 1.5 and 1.4, but I didn't really get that much time to download those updates, but, um, anyway, uh, today I actually wanted to uh, showcase and review all of the items which are included in the beta 1.2 or uh, mostly 1.2 version so um, yeah let's go ahead and let's actually uh, jump right into the review so uh, first thing I want to mention here is that uh, this one is a regular oak wood okay so uh, this has been pretty much been for a very long time in Minecraft and this right here is a stripped version of oak wood and pretty much all of the uh, stripped items or the stripped versions of these woods are available so that is actually a cool new feature so um, let's move on to the next one so uh, currently you can see that uh, the water texture has actually changed a little bit and I don't know why it it, it it looks like this it's like has a beautiful pattern but it's not really like this it's it's not the way how it looks this is pretty much the way how it looks it's turned a little bit more um a navy blue i guess and a little bit more blue bluish <laughs> and it was a little bit lighter on the older version so minecraft just keeps getting involved i mean evolved uh, uh pretty much fast oh and you can see that um the leaves right here they actually like have something if you actually jump down oh <laughs> that is the older update so anyway uh let's move on to the second one right here so these are actually uh the regular pressure plates like uh the gold the stone and the uh, wooden and the iron pressure plate and also the iron gate and these buttons are just regular and has always been uh, completely like modernly original so these ones right here are actually added in this update so um it, as you can see right here it's a oak and this one's a casia and jungle uh, uh pressure plate and buttons are also been added to it so that is pretty cool actually so yeah that is actually like if you want more decorative items then the these items are gonna be perfect for yeah so um yeah this one is actually a block of dried kelp so i don't know what this is but it's a new feature so i'm just gonna leave it uh over here and so let's take a look at the maps right here so these two maps it's an empty map and empty locator map so this one is just a basic empty map so if i create this um kind of like glitches up a little bit but um it's just normal and you can see right here it's just a normal map so if you actually use the empty locator map and actually see that you're actually moving um towards your it's like a live map like google the google maps it will show you your destination when you're moving so yeah i don't know how it works without machines you don't need any uh, android device or anything just to, uh, create an empty map locator uh, i don't really know the recipe right now but it's pretty much like this so anyway that is actually pretty cool so let's actually keep it this way the normal way how we actually used it so um, yeah, right now let's uh, take a look at the items here. So this one is the cooked fish uh, Fishes are actually added in this update. So this is pretty much the aquatic update uh, Named as the aquatic update. So these are seagrass um, cooked Salmon fish dried kelp, which is a block of dried kelp this one if, if I actually mentioned previously so um, this one is the trident so There is actually a way you can use this thing. So it's like um underwater king oh there we go dang head sir headshot so um anyway this thing is actually really powerful you can actually use it um, maybe like underwater and do a lot of different animations so um, yeah i think that is pretty cool so um now this one is the heart of the sea now this one doesn't really do anything right now but um i think they're gonna implement it or do something with it i don't know but um you're gonna have to know for from the developers soon enough and these are tropical fishes you can see there's puffer fish there is a tropical fish which looks like a clownfish and this one is a sea pickle 
and blue eyes these uh, two are literally one of the coolest ones so these two actually emit light source I mean the dry uh, what is it called the sea pickle actually emits light if you actually uh, move on the water you can see that it emits some sort of light um, a little bit you won't be actually able to observe it but uh, maybe on the night time and this is a blue ice so it's a new uh, completely new one um the dry ice ice and the packed ice and this one is a blue ice so you can actually find it in like new biomes called um, um, um snow biomes right here it's a new that's an uh like a uh, iceberg <laughs> biome thingy so um yeah let's actually put these things right here and there's raw fish, raw salmon, and kelp. So this one is the um, normal one, and this one is the dried one. So let's move on to the enchantments. I forgot to actually keep it. Whoa, how did this become two of them? But um, anyway, um, these are the enchantments that you can see. This is the impaling, impaling two, three, four, five, and this is the riptide one, two, three, and these loyalty one, two, three, and channeling. I have never heard of these enchantments before so must be a new enchantment feature so uh, now these are all the items you'll be able to find in the aquatic update like um, uh, the corals right here a uh, brain coral tube um, dead <laughs> I mean mostly dried and the tube corals brain coral blocks actually they look pretty cool actually so I'm actually gonna demonstrate you uh, these ones so uh, let's take some uh, demonstration of blocks and a natalis shell I don't know I have no idea what this thing is for but um anyway I'm just wanna have to I'm just gonna have to place it over here no we can actually place it um, at the corner of water so or maybe in the underwater so um, that's way that that is the way so you can place them so um, it's maybe like placed over here yeah I can see, as you can see right here and this one is a dead dead one so I have no idea what this one does and this one is the bubble coral the natalis, uh, natalis shell I don't know what this one does but I mean, anyway these blocks actually look pretty pretty cool so just wanted to showcase you these oh sorry about that um, it's okay <laughs> just wanted to showcase these so let's actually keep these things normally the way how it's actually been supposed to so now these are all the new mobs like the tropical fish codfish puffer salmon and the dolphins which are absolutely incredible and you'll be able to actually have fun with these dolphins so much so yeah so once you actually inside or on the corner of water i have no idea what these things um why they these make some cool patterns like web thingies but these waters are still and calm so i have no idea what how actually they work maybe a bug i guess so um these are all the dolphins so you, can you actually ride them or do something with them um i think not but they actually die when they can't find water i guess so these are um salmon fish so you can actually see them underwater it looks crazy i'm telling you it's it's absolutely crazy so these dolphins they can actually jump up sometimes <laughs> so that is pretty cool so now the puffer fish the puffer fish actually blows up, up as you can see right there uh whenever the player i think it actually gets close to it um the puffer fish actually puffs up self expands it so yeah now the codfish codfish uh, the tropical fish these tropical fish are actually random fishes so um i have no uh, detailed description about them but um anyway um i have no idea what the diamond sword is glitching you can you can see the diamond sword but um i have no idea what that how that happened but um anyway uh let's put on all of these uh mobs uh, right here and uh, oops <laughs> uh, it's really night so I gotta go to sleep but um anyway um, these are all the new blocks which is the uh, in the uh, education edition has been enabled in this update so what you can do here is that you can actually play with chemistry features like from the peri uh, periodic table and actually craft a lot of things like balloons with helium and pretty much a lot of things but um uh, especially if you're a student of science that you can pretty much be familiar with these like the compound creator element constructor 
a uh, lab table. I have no idea what these things are. And I'm a student of uh, business. My background is most, mostly a business. But uh, since I'm not really that much advanced in these science, <laughs> but um, I really don't know what to do with these. But um, you can actually give it a try. But if I actually learn how to craft one or uh, or learn the basics, I'll be able to teach you guys soon enough if I am willing to learn about these. So. And yeah, it's just like business background is kind of boring. I don't like it actually. It's not my personal favorite background either. Um, I actually love science, but still, I actually went to business for some reason. I don't know why. But um, anyway, I'll try to learn these things and also teach you guys as well. So this, uh, these are protons. You can actually uh, set them up uh, like one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three. These are a lot. <laughs> That's a lot. So, anyway, uh, that is pretty much going to be pretty much it for this update review. I have I said pretty twice. <laughs> but um, anyway, that is going to be pretty much it for this update review. So, if you guys uh, want more future update reviews, go ahead and comment down. And I'll try to reply and do some more future reviews as well. So, that is going to be pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. And stay, stay frosty, my friends. Thank you.